Last night, Jordan North completed yet another trial in the Celebrity Castle. He did so, so well. My next guest knows just what that takes, though, because she is the reigning queen of the jungle. Go! Go! My turn. I make this look easy. Hit it, boom like gasoline. Hit they call me Lamborghini, cause I know just what I'm worth. It's the devil who I hunted. Up my body, make him stutter. Fuck my engine, push the button. Hit them, don't be coming first. Who got the power? <laughs> The Queen, Jacqueline Josser, joins me now. It's lovely to see you. Some good memories there. Oh, yeah. I just want to do it all over again now. But, I mean, you were incredible because you started off really quite timid. I was a bit worried about you. And then this, this fantastic, I don't know, this, this amazing Amazon came out. It was <laughs> wonderful. It was absolutely brilliant. And you know what? You're going to be the longest serving Queen of the Jungle because whoever gets crowned King or Queen, they're the King or Queen of the Castle. So exactly. That, listen, I'm, I'll take that. I've been saying that the whole time. You bet. I get two years. I know. <laughs> I know. You could have gone back in there. You're not going to do that, but we will see you handing over your your crown. Yeah, I, I'm so excited. I would have gone back in like that. I, I, I'm, I'm busy this year, but I literally it was the best experience of my whole entire life. Honestly, Aww. I would love to do it all over again. It looks, it looks like you had the best time and I, I love seeing your reface at the end of that. But you did say you are busy and indeed you are. It's the West End debut. Do you remember we talked about this when you came yeah. on the show and you said, oh, what I'd really love to do is I'd love to do a West End show. And despite everything and despite COVID and all the rest of it, you are doing it. I know. And I'm doing it with people that I've like I've looked up to. Like Lucy Jones is one of like my favourite of all time musical theatre girls. And I'm actually in a musical theatre performance on West End with her. So like, yeah, it's almost a little bit of a pinch me moment. I'm terrified, um, but it's going to be fine. Of course it is. And of course, all of the safety measures will be in place in the theatre. There's not going to be as many people. You won't be performing to as many people, perhaps, as you would like, but it's oh, it well, fantastic. You know what, for me, I think this is, this is probably a perfect debut. Less people. Right. You know, <laughs> less nerves. <laughs> Hopefully I'll be better. <laughs> oh, no, it'll be great. You'll just, you'll enjoy, for goodness sake, if you can do all of those things that you did in the jungle, you, you can do anything. You know, that's the thing. I mean, so it, it must have really helped you though, Jacqueline. It must have helped your, your confidence, genuinely, helped you feel a much more confident person. 100%. I literally always say to absolutely everyone, you know, in this industry, you're talking, they, everyone's like, so what was the jungle really like? And I'm like, no, no, honestly, it was the best thing I've ever done in my whole entire life. I would recommend anyone that gets the chance to do it. I'm so jealous of the guys in there now. They're going to have the best experience of their whole entire lives. And it's definitely changed me 100%. Good. I'm glad to hear it. I'm very, very glad to hear it. And you know what really, do you know what really annoyed me as a woman who sort of goes from a size 10 to a size 14, depending on how much chocolate I eat? You're, yes. a, si you're a size 12 and probably tinier than that. And you were called plus size Jacqueline. Somebody said a size 12. How can that possibly be? I don't understand. It's a weird one, isn't it? Isn't because it? I'm not really like offended by plus size I just don't really know why it has to be addressed and I just think it's not fair for people that are size 14 16 18 you know living their best lives that yeah. they start then comparing to a size 12 body and thinking that that's plus size well then what am I yeah it's just it's just so ridiculous because a size 12 two different size 12s could be a massive difference in actual weight difference sure. In height, there's yeah. there's such different ways you can be. So it really doesn't mean anything. Doesn't like, I like to go a bit bigger on the jeans because I like a little bit of movement, a little bit of room. I hear you. I hear you. I mean, I always go for like <laughs> extra large, big kind of jumpers sometimes, and I have it to. It makes you feel really good, doesn't it, it does. when you're in the big? It does. Stick a belt on it. <laughs> And you're fine, and it depends what shop you go into. Some shops you can you can squeeze yourself into a size ten, and other shops you can't. And it shouldn't matter. Yeah. You're absolutely right. It shouldn't matter as long as you're you're healthy and happy, which indeed you are. Things are going so well. I'm so delighted for you. And how how's the family? How's everybody? Okay. Oh, so good, so good. Ella's doing school now. Obviously, wow. homeschooling was um, a task, but. <laughs> 
I'm glad she's back at school now. She's loving it. Mia, terrible twos have have definitely hit, but she's honestly amazing. Yeah, me and Daniel are really good. good. Loving I'm life. Great. Excited for Christmas. I'm so the Christmas decorations are going up this weekend. Do you know what? Usually I would get cross at that, but as I've said this week, let's just do it. Let's just do it early. Exactly. The year we've had, we have to do it. And you know, and make it still have Christmas, but just make it a little bit smaller for everybody so that we're all yeah. so that we're all so that we're all safe. Well, look, when does everything start? When can we see you in the West End? So on the 7th of December in the Dominion Theatre, I will be there with everybody else. <laughs> I'm so excited. I cannot wait. Please come and see me. Give us a big love cheer. To, I would love to come and see you. I think that's what we need to get into the real sort of Christmas spirit, especially a show like that, you know, based on Charles Dickens. I know, Christmas, Christmas Carol. I'm Christmas. so excited. The music is so good. I'm so, uh, Honestly... This is, it's just the best thing, a perfect way to finish the year, I think. It is on a, on a nice high, on a nice high. Yeah. Thank you, my angel. It's a joy to see you and good luck with everything you do. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so Thank much. You. Bye. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.